Hi everyone, Ash 20 x here and today we're going to review the iOS 11 running in the iPhone 6X and we're going to update to review it and to show to you. Let's go! Ash 20 x games, tutorials, unboxings, reviews. I'm happy to help you. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel in order to receive new content. What's up my friends, Ash 20 x here and today we're going to review the iPhone 6X running iOS 11 and of course Today, iOS 11 has been released to the general public and we're going to review running in this device because since this is our device now, this is the 6S, we're going to review how it performs, how the game runs and how the social media application runs in this device. So we're going to start with the first thing. So we're going to go to settings and we're going to go to about and we're going to see how the build number and as you can see here is 58372. So that will be the Go Master. So if you have the Go Master, you don't need to come back here because uh, it's the same build, so you don't have to update. So as you can see here, this is the lock screen right now. And as you can see here, this will be the control center, but you can add more things. Have here is the rig next section right here and the volume section right here so if you want to decrease the volume and also we got the flash so the flash is very uh, good right now because you can control the, the, the amount of light as you can see here it's really good in order to use in darker place so this will be handy and of course we're gonna turn this off and we're gonna proceed with a few things so of course we're gonna unlock the device start to open some applications in order to see how it performs so one two three mail mails open fine we're gonna go to calendar and calendar just open fine without any problems so photos just open fine and as you can see here it is running super well um, the camera app so we're gonna take a few pictures right here and in order to to see so let me show my face right here so what's up people and by the way I'm using the phone in order to record this so yeah anyways changing this you got the, the classic uh, pictures video slow-mo if so you want to take small slow-mo and also time blades right here so we're gonna go back right here and everything is working just fine so we're gonna open maps and map maps is working fine so what we're gonna do we're gonna go to this place right here and to see what we i'm from puerto rico and of course it's a far away place but i really like this place i'm being there and as you can see here everything is working what it's supposed to do it is working very well let me clean this right here it's just i like to have the of course the screen very clean very important so it is working just fine okay so we're gonna open the clock clocks just open fine no problem whatsoever so you have your stopwatch your classic timer and also if you want to sleep well you can use this application and you can set up the time in order to use sleep so head out to the water app um, talking about water we're gonna we are in the in the course of a app store that is gonna come to Puerto Rico so send your prayers to here because Tomorrow we're gonna have a big storm. It is called Maria and Maria is going to hit us hard tomorrow. So that's why I'm doing this video today. But as you can see here, everything is working just fine. And as you can see here, everything from here, we're gonna have a lot of rains up to maybe, wow. So the sun will be arrived at 6.12. But as you can see here, we got a lot of rains and everything is gonna be very crazy and a lot of winds. So anyways, chaining to the wallet and you have your classic wallets, everything is in the same. And we're gonna head out to the notes and we're going to try to make a few texts right here. And of course, I like to open and test the voice manager in ios devices since i speak spanish i'm gonna do it in spanish and also in english so we're gonna try and it's in english so we're gonna call the voice over hi my name is osh no all right no 
No, 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 no. Okay. It's telling me that you are hearing me. Well, you are here with me too, but okay, it's working. All right. Now we're gonna change right here. And I don't kind of like this. Now you have to uh, like force if you're trying to go back, it I'm going to change that. So you have to press a keyboard right here, but I'm gonna do it in Spanish also. Hola, ¿cómo estás? ¿Cómo te ha ido tu día? Tenemos un huracán en nuestro sistema que nos va a pasar por la piedra. Estoy muy asustado. Ja, ja, ja. And as you can see here, everything is just working fine. I'm impressed. So, uh, we're going to type right here. Of course, the keyboard is the one that always impacted by the software update. So, we're going to try to open the typer right here. Hi. Hi, how has, how you have been, my friend. So everything is working fine. And also you can draw whatever you want. You can put bullets. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna try to draw something right here. And I'm not sure, let me go and draw. As always, I do the brown heart that I try to do, but let me try to, I can't. I just can't, wow. It is impossible to use two hands to drop, that's crazy. So as you can see here, it is working just fine without, just without hand, one hand. So we're gonna head out back. And as you can see here, that part is working just fine. So head out to the reminder, everything is just working as wise to, to have to work. So if you open a reminder, you can add a few things inside the reminders that not change at all. So. Um, of course, the, the most things that change are the app store issue. I right know the, the app store has been uh, changed a lot. And also you cannot run any more 32 apps. So if you have 32 apps now, this is not going to work. Um, you have to, uh, The developer have to upgrade the apps in order to this work. But as you can see, very fluid, very beautiful. I like the new style. I like how it, it performs. And as you can see here, everything is just working amazing. I'm, I'm impressed by this software. It's working better than anything else. So as you can see here, everything is just amazing. So if you have a device in your home, you can use this, uh, but I don't have any device right now uh, for doing. And of course the health. So you can add a few things and you can put your information and stuff like that. Anyways, we're gonna go to, of course, we're gonna start to dig in inside the device. We're gonna open Facebook and to see how uh, Facebook is running in the device. And I know a lot of people, uh, this is not a, a, a app bundled with, with the App Store, but of course it is application that sometimes can take a lot of things to load. And now as you can see here, and so you already don't have me, you can go and look for me. And as you can see here, we are, in the Facebook application and it's running just fine. Head out to another game. We're gonna open games and to see how is the performance of the games. And we're gonna open a uh, random game, of course, to to see how it performs the game. So I'm gonna try to quit uh, to quit development because I don't going to. Let me check. And as you can see here, really good game by the way. I really enjoy this game. And. There you go, my friends. And as you can see, uh, you can still use this game for heavy games or lightweight games. So it depends on your likes. Uh, yeah. We're gonna close this. And of course, if you want to add few few apps inside your calendar or your time, your control center, you can do it. So we're gonna pause this and we're gonna cancel this. In order to do that, you're gonna go to settings and in settings, you're gonna go to scroll down and then you're gonna press control center and then you're gonna press customize controls and then here you can add a few things you want to, whatever you want. And of course you can also uh, grab it here there and now we got more and also you can screen recorder your device now so now you can screen 
uh, recorder and if you're planning to use this in Snapchat, Snapchat has already patched this so you cannot use it in Snapchat. Sorry my friends, if you want to spy your friends, this is not the way that you should do. Anyways, when you finish you just tap the video and then you, you want to press stop and then it's going to show you this. But also if you press here this and it's going to make a screenshot and then you can edit this screenshot whatever you want to do and you can dry it and then you can done and of course it's gonna save so we're gonna save this as a photo and of course we're gonna go to the safari website and we're gonna go to the apple website in order to see uh, the new devices and now ios 11 has been launched of course we have the news in spanish but as you can see here everything is working just fine we're gonna go to HTML5 test so we're gonna make a test right here and we're gonna press here and to see how is the performance in this version and as you can see here we are in 1458 and that's really nice so we're gonna open YouTube of course and YouTube is gonna open just fine and as you can see here everything is open just fine we're gonna go to my channel and to see my latest video right here and as you can see here I was speaking about the situation that uh, that Apple of course situation sorry guys but as you can see here it is working just fine no lags whatsoever so everything just worked just fine and by the way you can subscribe to my channel if you want to muy buenos días suscriptores de YouTube en mi canal Osh Pentec, espero que se encuentren muy bien. Eh, están pasando muchas cosas, así que voy a hablar rápido del tema más principal. Also, if you want to see the performance of the iPhone 5S, you can go here and you can do it too. Hello, friends, Osh Pentec here, and today we're going to review the iOS Go Master, iOS 11 Go Master in the iPhone 5S, since this is the only device that Apple will support. Uh, in this version, we're gonna... But it's working just fine. And what we're gonna do right now, too, we're going to, of course, we're gonna look for speed test and I want to see how is the speed inside the device. So we're gonna hit begin and to see how this is the speed in this device. So, and I really like uh, iOS 11, it's running very well, it's very optimized. And as you can see here, I already have a notification right here from a YouTuber. So in order to see that notification, I just scroll down and I can also, I can press here as just like this, or you can also, you can hard press with 3D touch and then you can go and open that or clean that. So whatever you like, so we're gonna clean those. The things, this, this is not perfect right now, so I'm not sure how Apple will fix that and remember that Apple have the new device that is running without a bottom. So I'm planning to take that device in my channel in order to make an unboxing. Moment we are in iOS 11. Stuck in iOS 11. This is the final version of iOS 11, but as you can see here, everything is working fine. So we're gonna go to Keep Bench. Of course, I like to, to bench my score. All right, the score has been finished and now we have 2,542 for the single score and 4,435 for the multiple score. So anyways, I hope you like this video. As always, like and subscribe and thank you for everything and peace out, my friends. See you.